everyone i hope you are doing good and you are safe at home today we have yet another interesting topic and that is about ash wednesday let's have a look at what it means what do you think ash wednesday is about why is it called ash wednesday ash wednesday is a holy day that is set apart for prayer and fasting this is the first day of the season of lent on ash wednesday the priest collects the crosses and he burns it and then he puts it on our forehead this is the same cross that we receive on palm sunday the day we receive the cross on palm sunday we take it home and we hang it you can symbolize this as to how jesus is with us watching everything that we do during the year and then on ash wednesday we take the same cross to our church and then the priest burns it this can be a symbol of how we are taking all our sins back to god here we are laying down our sins at god's feet and asking him to forgive us in psalm chapter 51 verse 2 to 4 it says wash away all my sins and cleanse me from my sin for i know my transgressions and my sin is always before me against you and only you i have sinned later on when you look at this psalm it talks about how david is asking god to forgive him for his sins and wash him completely clean remember that in this world no human being is perfect everybody around us including myself am sinful because as human beings we are always prone to do the wrong thing but when we sin it is important to ask god for forgiveness because he can wash us clean and forgive us from all our sins when you are truly sorry it means that you will not be doing the same thing again that also means that you will change your behavior when you truly repent ask god to forgive you and move away it means that you will not be going back to the same old thing again in the season of lent i want to challenge you to think of something that you want to give up maybe it could be a bad habit maybe it could be um that you'll be more nicer to your friends or your family whatever it is think of something that you can give up something that makes jesus sad and try doing that why is this important is because in the season of lent jesus also decided to fast and pray and he had to give up so many things in order to save us from our sins so let's remember what jesus did and let's take it up as a challenge and i want you to think of something that you can give up do not tell this to anybody why because let it be between you and god alone i would like to end with a small chorus so let's have a look at what it is The memory verse for today is Psalm chapter 51 verse 10. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit 
within me. Hope you enjoy today's lesson. Till I see you next, take care and God bless you all. Bye.